Hey guys, it's Erica. It's November 6th and this is a shopping trip from Rite Aid. Starting with the um, Arm & Hammer liquid. That was on sale for or priced at two for seven dollars and you get back three up rewards making those like two dollars a piece. Uh, I didn't think that was too bad so I grabbed them. They are five ounces smaller than the typical bottles that we get. Um, so you know that's something to consider when you're doing this deal. And um, actually this is my first transaction. I also did the Colgate. As you can see there it is, or maybe not because it's kind of blurry using my other camera. Um, they are priced at $3.50 a piece and um, you get $3.50 back. So that's like free, but if you were smart and had the Walgreens Diabetes and You booklet, there was a dollar off any Colgate total in that um, booklet. Therefore, that made um, buying this toothpaste a money maker. And I did that three times. There is um, an additional uh, dry mouth relief mouthwash attached to these. See, that's one pack, that's another. And I took one off because I actually wanted to try out the dry mouth um, mouthwash. So that was a pretty good deal for actually making money. So by me going into the store and presenting them with that coupon, I was able to not only get my money back, I did have to pay the 350 out of pocket, but I got that right back and um, plus a dollar because of the coupon three times and I took each of those um, 350 off uh, up rewards and flipped them and used them to buy some of the other products that are on the table so that's how the toothpaste and the deodorant worked the um, Lysol that was priced at $9.99 and you get um, five dollars back and up rewards they also say that there was a three dollar off manufacturer coupon we didn't get that coupon in this area but i did use the uh, 150 off coupon in the flu booklet so i was able to save a little bit like that so um at the end of the day i paid 350 for the awesome no touch hand soap dispenser and those are really neat um, I have two already, but I have two bathrooms, and I wanted to get one for the upstairs bathroom because right now I have one in the upstairs bathroom, one in the downstairs bathroom, and one in the kitchen. So this will be another one for um, upstairs now. And um, at that price, I thought it was pretty good. So I actually paid. Um, I had to pay. Um, what? What did I pay? Seven dollars eight fifty. I paid eight fifty yeah because I had the one dollar fifty coupon. So I paid eight fifty, but I got back the five dollars in up rewards. So that was like paying only three fifty because I got the up reward back and took that and bought some other things. Also, here is the um, deodorant. Um, that I chose the. Ultramax um, Arm and Hammer because I didn't have coupons for either. You could have done the Arid or the uh, Arm and Hammer, but I have never tried Arm and Hammer, and I actually um, took advantage of the Arid last time when it was free at Walgreens. Had a dollar off coupon. They were priced at 99 cents, and I didn't really care for the Arid um, deodorant, but I like um, the smell of this. Arm and Hammer. It's just powder fresh, but I, I like it. It seems um, it's I like it better than what the Arid had to offer. So those were two for four, and you get back three dollars in up rewards. So that is like paying only two for a dollar, so fifty cents a piece, which is not bad for deodorant. Um, so I did that. I also did the Viva. Those were. $7.49 and then you get back an up reward of a dollar but I had a dollar off of Viva so I only paid $5.49 and I took some of those um, register rewards and um, that I got from the toothpaste I believe yeah the toothpaste because I had like over $10 come, come back to me over $10 yeah for the toothpaste and up rewards um, so I, I believe that's where that went. 
and um, I also did the curry. That was another good um, reward, up reward. Um, six ninety nine, and you get six dollars in up rewards back. But I had one of those two dollar off curry coupons left, and so that gave me a dollar money maker. So not only was it free, I made a dollar off of it. And as you can see, I've never seen this before. The curry comes in shea butter. So I snatched that up really quick because I like shea butter and I like curry and I thought the two of them together would make a good combo. Curry's a good lotion anyways. Okay, I just stacked up. I guess I had some good coupons. Um, this is the kind of you know sale you want is when you have items that you will really use and you have some awesome coupons and some um, good um, sales to stack. Uh, match them up with okay the I'm a little sick guys I don't feel good I can barely breathe here so forgive me for um, sounding the way I do oh, and breathing heavy <laughs> um, $2.99 was the price of the toothbrushes those are the 360s I love those toothbrushes um, I had a $1 off coupon making them $1.99 and you, as you can see you get $2 in up rewards back so those were free. Um, so I was glad to get those. And then I just realized this razor does not even belong in here. <laughs> that was not part of this purchase. <laughs> I'm looking at that like that's kind of an oddball thing. Alright. Um, See, everything was on the first page, so I didn't have to go flipping through everything. Let's see here. Where's the stay free? I forget the deal on that. Um, okay, well, the Advil. You get a dollar up reward back on that. And I think I had a dollar off, maybe two dollars off. No, I think it was a dollar off of Advil. I'm not sure. I needed some, so I just got it. <laughs> And don't you know? I'm probably missing some deals. I see some other things as I'm flipping through here. Oh, here's the boogie wipes. Those are for a family member. We got a little toddler in the uh, family. And those were priced at, those things are expensive. Good lord. Little wipes, and there are only 30 in there. But, anyways, they're $3.99. You get a single check rebate for two bucks and an up reward. And I had 50 cents off. So that's how I did that one. Oh, goodness. I wish I could take the time to really break everything down for you guys. I'm just. Oh, my time is. I'm, by the time I find time to do the videos, I'm tired, very exhausted. And then this season is coming up where I, yeah, I just don't feel good, really. Um, I don't know what happened with the Safries. I know the Safries had peelies on them. Um, so that was a nice deal. Oh, wow. They were right on the front page. See, this is what happens when you do videos late at night. $3 off. Um, see, once again, regional coupon because this $1 off coupon that they're advertising here. And that's why they say most Sunday papers because we didn't get it. So... Um, but there was a Peely. I think the Peely was for a dollar off. So it worked out. I still got the deal. And you get two dollars in up rewards. So it was like getting them for free. And, um, I think that is that. Um, also there's a get one dollar back rebate. And that was for the, um, Lysol thingy, as you can see. So not only did I save with the coupon and the up rewards, I will uh, submit that rebate. And um, I got back, uh, let's see, about $14 in up rewards. And actually, I came in the door with the $15 from last week's up rewards. And um, so that's not too bad. Came in the door with 15 in up rewards. I did spend my subtotal for the first, which was the total 
the laundry detergent and the Viva, or no, the Viva was last, I'm sorry, the Curie, the Curie was like $16, so, um, yeah, that's about all I spent out of pocket, and then with the 15 and up rewards, I, um, put that towards the whole purchase, and then had to pay, I had to pay the 16 and then I took the up rewards that I received from that transaction and um, used them towards the rest of these things here, the Stay Free, the toothbrushes, and then all of these are what I had left over. And there's like $3 there for up rewards, $2, $2, $1, $3, $1, $2. So I think that's like $14. So I pretty much walked out with the same amount of um, up rewards, which isn't too bad for only spending 16 and getting all this product. So um, thanks for watching, guys. That's it for Rite Aid. And up next will be, I think, Walgreens.